What's up, everybody? Hey, this is Conversation with PT. Hey, this is the day the Lord has made. We will, we shall rejoice and be glad in it. Today, we've been discussing, um, even on yesterday, we talked about joy. So let's get to it. Let's get to it. Let's talk about it. Can you always, the question today is, can you always have joy? It is a question that many people ask daily. Is there, can I always have joy? Is it something I need to work for? Um, let's find out what, can you always have joy? Well, let's see what the scripture says about, about joy. John 15 and 11, it says, these things I've spoken to you, that my joy may remain in you, that your joy may be full. Now, think about that. John, who is the, um, the writer of this book, The Beloved, he tells us what Jesus says in John 15 and 11. Now, we know we need to go into previous verses to find out what he is saying here. But let's pick up here. It says, these things I've spoken to you that my joy may remain in you. There's something that can we always have joy? Our, we can have joy that when we connect with Jesus' joy. He said that my joy may remain in you. Well, you remember the scripture. He says um, that, um, that you have joy. Um, of salvation um, the joy of the Lord is my, is our, our salvation so when you see salvation that that means secure that means deliverance that means savior that means uh, security that means prosperity so everything you need is in him everything that you need is in him so yes you can have joy yes you can have joy yes you can have joy we talked about yesterday previously that no one can take away your joy. It is a deep, enduring state of, of our soul that no circumstance, event, or human can steal away from us. This is the joy of the Lord, which is our strength. So I'm, in, I'm praying and believing God that the joy of the Lord will come back. If you've lost it, if you have wavered or you feel like it's no longer there, I pray that the joy of the Lord will come back, that will um, penetrate your heart, your spirit, your mind, your well-being, because everything you need, it remains in Him. He's getting ready to give it to you. He died for you so that you can have joy. Hey, this is Conversation with PT. Know that no weapon formed against you shall be able to prosper. Be blessed in Jesus' name.